Hey guys, this is a Droid Tutor review of the Android app Prey. It's a free open source app that lets you track and find your Android device or even laptop if it ever gets stolen. It works really good. I tested it on both an Android device and a PC laptop. So this is how you get it started. First, you go to preyproject.com, create an account, which I did. Uh, then you can add devices. So I added two devices here, the PC base laptop. They also support Mac and Linux laptops. And I also installed uh, the device on my Vibrant. So first thing I'll do is look at the control panel for the Vibrant. So you can see it's not missing because I didn't tell it that it's missing. You can give it a title. <clears throat> you can control uh, what kind of geolocation you want in your reports. If it ever gets stolen, then it'll email you these reports. And a couple of action modules. One is an alarm and one is an alert. There are more modules on the PC uh, based version. Like you can use the webcam to take a picture of whoever stole your machine or has your machine and so forth. But for the <clears throat> the Android device you only have a couple so I'm going to turn on the alarm and turn on the alert so the alert you see you can put whatever message you want uh, you can change the wallpaper and even have it uh, actually the same message doesn't work same message is only for Mac or Linux uh, computers so I guess I'll just turn that off okay. so that's it so I'll update that and you can see that it's ready to go all right, next step is to configure the device. So I downloaded Prey from the marketplace and I installed it. The first time you install it, it's gonna ask you to sync up with the preyproject.com username and password, which I already did. Then each time you launch it, you just have to punch in your password, which I'll do off screen here. Okay. And just a couple of key things here. One is uh, to activate Prey to let it know that the phone is stolen or missing. All you got to do is SMS your phone number. And you set that, that keyword or passphrase here. So I won't click on it. But if I click on that, whatever I punch in there will be the SMS uh, passphrase. And it's case sensitive. So I'm going to show you how that works. And then how to deactivate it. There's a specific message there as well. And some other things too, like changing your passwords and, and stopping Prey and so forth. But not going to do that. What I'm going to do is actually just SMS myself and you'll see that um, the device would uh, go on and the alarm would sound and the message would show based on the configuration you have set at preyproject.com. So in this case I have alarm and alert. So let's go ahead and, and send myself an SMS. I'm going to do that off screen again. Okay. Sorry, this is taking me a little while here. Okay, now I punch in my password. So what I'm doing here is SMSing myself the password to turn on the activation code. So I just sent it. And let's see what happens. way to set up uh, security on your Android device.